<laughs> How's it going everyone? Welcome back again with Indogamer Z. So, um, recently the new update for Heroes and Generals, Everhard Knights of the Road has been happening. And I just have it updated last night in Australian time. And it was amazing. Although there are some things that I think um, doesn't really work properly. Um, okay, here we go. So, according to the video updates, this patch introduced um, new trucks, camo changes on spawns and camera, and um, dead cam and drive cam. So, here's what I thought about it. First of all, um, the main screen for the game looked beautiful and artistic. Um, maybe I just noticed it, but I think it's a little bit more toned down than previously and it just give that relaxed ambient, you know, um, just to reduce your stress after the war. Not really. Anyway, um, the truck for all the faction, man, it is a great addition to the game. I think um, this beast can actually be the throw in your game. You can just, if you keep losing, and then someone use this truck and manage to get it fully packed with infantry behind the enemy lines, that's it. You might win the game. Um, I haven't seen the new camo yet, but looking at the video, it looks like a swampy green color. So it may not work properly in um, in some of the autumn map or probably all those wheat field, you know, because it's a brownish color, yellow. But I guess it's a matter of preference at the end of the day. The next thing on the list is the update on the camera um, the spawn camera looks smoother and I think it's better um, however however I'm rather disappointed with the death cam and the driver cam the first one um, the thing is with the death cam it's just that it moves a lot before focusing on your killer it's probably uh, because the point of it is actually to see what your character is seeing or, or um, follow his head movement when he dies which is absolutely fantastic but I don't know about you sometimes I just feel a bit nauseous looking at it especially if the body gets tossed around you know but I really think it's an, an awesome addition and I might need to get used to it is all um, I also noticed that the driver getting in or out of the vehicle, the camera on it seems to add the time it takes to the action. I might be wrong, but it feels like I'm getting out of my tank or my jeep longer than usual. And the smooth camera angle transition seems a bit slow. So what do you guys think? There's also some other minor glitch on top, um, such as Integrating body when he died, and white pixels showing up in the trees. Well, probably it's just my computer. But overall, I actually enjoyed this patch. Although the camera movement can be limited if the body getting tossed around, and it actually does feel more realistic in a way. And those trucks, man, it will definitely change the game tactics. You'll see. That's all from me. Until next time, let me know what you think and don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. Cheers!